we saw all the cop cars and everything, and then we looked out in the field and we saw the moose, and it was just kind of running around, and then the cop cars kind of kept driving, kind of closing in on it, and it came over here, and it just dropped right over there. It was it was really lethargic and slow, and then it just kind of put its hind legs down, and and then put its front legs down, and and then it was it was down. Anyway, they'd close the streets off because they were afraid that the uh, animal would come out into traffic. Uh, really, uh, it's good that the animal laid down, uh, and so it kind of keeps things pretty neutral. Uh, so they were there just monitoring it for a little while. Uh, then we uh, darted the animal, uh, and uh, it takes about a minute, minute and a half for it to go down. And then from there, we uh, uh, load the animal in and, and transport it somewhere else. We'll use two. Looks like it's a, a yearling bull. It's probably been uh, forced off of its mother. Its mother's probably getting ready to have a calf this year. And so he, he's wandering, and, and sometimes they find their way to town to uh, get away from all the, the bigger bulls that, that don't want him around. And that, that's fairly typical for, for what we see in town. Usually it's a yearling, or sometimes it's an older animal that's having trouble making it on the mountain. And so. It was exciting. It was fun. I knew they weren't hurting it because I saw the big dart sticking out of it, so we were excited. I don't know what we're going to do the rest of the day that's going to top it. <laughs>